I'm a huge Betty Davis fan, always have been from the time I was 12 years old. My grandmother, whom I always called Old Ma, she was a huge fan, so that's how I got hooked on Betty Davis. One day, many, many years later, I was a kid growing up in Cleveland. I moved to Connecticut, and I invite a friend of mine whom I had seen in um, the a &P, and I asked her if she would like to come over for dinner. And she said she'd love to, but she had a house guest staying with her. It was an old childhood chomp. And at seven o'clock sharp, the doorbell rings. And there was the first lady of the silver screen standing at the doorstep of my little New England cottage. And she was holding a pot of baked beans in one hand and a cigarette in the other. She said she was coming for a night, possibly two. And she ended up staying for 32 days. And during those 32 days, it was an amazing ride with Betty Davis living in the house. It's a two-person show. I play myself, my four-year-old son, my husband, John, and Betty is played by this fabulous male actor, Kelly Moore. People have been walking away saying they didn't expect it to be so touching. And it is funny, it's a comedy and nobody is funnier than Betty Davis being with an ordinary family and riding shotgun in my beat up Toyota. It was just the strangest, most bizarre event and that was so deeply touching. And I think the audience is really picking up on that yes, it's funny, but it's also on, on many different levels. Um, that's what people are saying, that it's very touching and they didn't expect that.